Hey everyone, today we're going to do a quick video on the how to send a folder through your email. Now this um, may seem elementary for some people, but for others they find that um, they can't send folders and they don't know why. So what I'm going to do is just a quick tip video on how to do that. And we're going to start with first having a folder here. And let me go ahead and open up my browser, hit compose. And if you saw my other video, we could you know typically just drag and drop um, a file. So for instance, we can hit attach a file so for instance we can just go ahead and open up this file here we have a couple of pictures and what we want to do is we want to send maybe a couple of these now what we can do is we can actually grab them and drag it in here and attach it that way now what if we wanted to send the whole folder instead of one by one and all the differences well we can do that too um, so instead of doing that let's go ahead and remove this one and we'll go ahead and start again. Compose a new mail. Now if you try to do a whole folder, it says attachment fail. You can't do a whole folder just like this. So what we can do is, we'll do what's called creating a zip file. You can right click on a Windows machine and click on send to compress zip folder. Now we have our zip folder that was just created here and from there we can now attach it and drag it in here so on a Windows machine that's how that would work now the same thing can be done on a Mac so while this is uploading let's go over to our Mac screen and this is how this is the folder that we have that we want to now send off and on a Mac all you need to do is you can either hold your control key down while you click on it if you have a single mouse or if you have two buttons on your mouse simply right click and click on compress my folder to send the Mac will then create this zip folder and you can now attach this to your email program and it'll be sent out from there. So let's check back to see if our attachment is done. And it is. And all we need to do now is go ahead and send our the zip file. So the other side, people, today with anything with a Windows XP and above and um, most of the Mac programs can automatically unzip zip files without a problem. And you'll be able to send out your multiple files. Thank you for joining us, and that's another Tips by Chris at tipsandchris.com. Thanks.